everybody, this is Chris Yotaka here back with another unboxing. Today I have an unboxing from eBay. I bought this off a seller off eBay, and as you saw from the title, I will be unboxing Psychopath Season 1 Blu-ray Premium Edition. I know this is out of print. This has been out of print, I think, for over, I would say, a year now. And I know I could have picked up the standard edition, but I really wanted to pick this up. I know, I, I was always wanting to pick it up, but, you know, I thought it was too expensive, but, you know those eBay prices. But let's get to the unboxing. Um, I sort of, I cut it open a little bit already because um, I tried recording this earlier and I could not get this open at all whatsoever. And I was really, I was really nervous. I'm a little nervous about it because I'm not a huge fan of the packaging. But here it is, Psychopaths, the premium edition. Um, yes, I did pick this up off eBay. This is brand new, like, out of the box. This is brand new. But, um, I know that there's issues with it, um, in regarding... I know there's two, uh, different types of art boxes. I know one, like, there's, like, the leaning, like, the box is, like, leaning. I know there's another one where the art box is, like, really tight and, like, all the content is really hard to get out. Here's the front. This is, again, this is the Season 1 Premium Edition. Here is the spine. Oh, uh, let me just see now, actually. Okay, this is the leaning one. Eh, I don't care. Here is the back. Um, I really don't know anything about the series. I know there's been hundreds of unboxings for this series. So, I mean, I'm not going to go in depth. But um, here are the Blu-ray specs, if I can focus. Again, it's this is the season one. It's 22 episodes on Blu-ray, no DVD. 1080p high definition, 69.9, WHD 5.1, and Japanese 2.0, and then 48 minutes of special features. Um, this is, again comes with the two-disc soundtrack, and also comes with the you know the ID holder, uh, the case, uh, the ID holder, the card case, and um, I think what else does it come with? Oh yeah, and the keychain. But uh, I honestly, I like how it. I like my voice is cracked. I like the actually it came out decent. I was really again I was nervous because of the packaging, but I'm pretty fine with it. But yeah, again I, for the third time saying this, I picked this up of a seller. This guy is selling. He sells a lot of anime, and um, he actually has a lot of copies of the Psycho Pass Premium Edition. I think he does because like every time every a lot of people who. A lot of people that I saw purchase items off this seller has purchased the Psycho Pass limited edition off him. But he has a lot of other items, like um, other like rare, like I guess more rare items you can say. But uh, yeah, he's a good seller. Um, I just got this today. I was actually shocked I got it today because it was um, supposed to be. It's it was shipped from California, so I thought it was going to be like a week, week or so. But um. But yeah, here's the front, and then let's remove the back. Um, I know her name. I know this is Akane Sunimori, and I know it's played by Kana Hazawa, who also plays Kosaki Onodera from Nisekoi. And here is the spine. Again, I know how this this has been unboxed many times already. But as we take out the contents. This is um, this is the Blu-rays. Here is the front spine. Again, this is the first season with as I focus, focus doesn't want to focus. Here we go. One to twenty-two episodes. One to twenty-two. Here is the back. I know this is the cover for the first um, volume. This is the first cover of the Japanese volume. I know that. Um, here's a filming out. I love these. But uh, four Blu-ray discs. This is a Blu-ray only premium edition. Again, this premium edition is out of print. I don't know a lot of people know. I guess a lot of people do know about this. It is out of print. Um, you can pick up the standard edition much cheaper on right stuff. You can pick it up. If you have a got anime membership, you can pick it up for like $41, I believe. And you buy the two of them, so it together it'd be 82 bucks, which is not bad for a 22 episode series. Uh, I know the standard MSRP for this set was originally $129. I paid just around that off eBay. And again, I did pick this up. Um, I think he has some copies left, but I'm not sure. Here's disc one, episodes one through eight. 
Here is Blu-ray Disc 2, which is 9 through 11, and here is Blu-ray Disc 3, which is 12 to 19. And then here is the final disc for Season 1, and it's Episodes 20 to 22, and it has some artwork on the back. Um, I don't know, I know that there's a second season for this series, and I also know that there's a film, but I don't know when that's going to be released by Funimation. I'm assuming they're gonna release the second season, I guess? I think it's supposed to be released sometime, sometime, I think by the end of next year. But here's the soundtrack as I continue rambling. Here is the season one soundtrack, Spine. As whatever season one soundtrack, it had this all together has around 15 tracks each on two discs, so all together is 30. And then here is the two discs, and there is some artwork on the back. Here's one of the art pieces. I like the like the linear artwork for this series. I also like how the cover is reversible. I think that's a really, I think that's a nice touch. And then I know that it has those like those those bonus contents, but honestly, I, I don't think the bonus contents were that nice. And here is the filler box. Again, the filler. Um, this comes with a logo decal. It also comes with a keychain. It also comes with a ID card holder. as I try to get the contents out. Okay. Here is the decal. I'm assuming it's like a, either you put this on a shirt, like you iron, is it iron on? Not 100% sure. Here is the little wallet holder. And as you can see, as I try to focus. There we go. As it says over here, it says Department of Ministry of Welfare, Public Safety Bureau, Criminal Investigation. I've never seen this series, always wanted to. The dub looks amazing. It sounds amazing, I'm sorry. And um, I, I also like that this series, like the endings, ending tracks are by Egoist. I'm a huge fan of, you know, Egoist, if you don't know, is the, um, it's the band. It's the fake band made in the anime known as Guilty Crown. And um, it's the same company that produced Psychopaths Production ID, IG. And um, I really like the band Egoist. I love their songs. I have a lot of my, I have a few of their songs on my iPod. So that's why, like, I also wanted to buy the series because, like, this, the, those end tracks I really did enjoy. But uh, here is the card holder. It says the same thing the, part, the Minister, Department, Ministry of Wealth and Public Safety Bureau, Criminal Investigation. Here's the traditional thing, I mean, traditional Funimation logo. Looking, I mean, honestly, this is a pretty, I think this is pretty cheap. It's stupid little add-ons. Keychain is nice. Same thing. Department of Ministry of Wealth and so forth. Oh, you can see my face. But yeah, it's a nice, I like the keychain. It's nice. It's not like it's gonna go any, it's not like it's gonna go on my keys. But, um... Yeah, that's pretty much it for this, I guess you can say, quick little unboxing. Um, I do have, my this this month isn't going to be a really huge, it's really going to be a huge unboxing, like, not a huge, like I'm not going to have a lot of, like, I mean, I'm going to have a decent amount of unboxing videos, but a lot of it is not anime related. Um, most of the stuff I bought this month is basically from Tokyo Taco Mode, and if I did purchase items from Right Stuff, it's mostly... It's mostly just items that, like, they're just standard edition items. I mean, like, for example, like, I bought, like, the Future Diary Blu-ray. I bought, um, I don't know what else I bought. I bought, that's one example of what I purchased. But it's mostly, yeah, not going to be anything too spectacular. But, you know, hold on until September when all the, the huge ticket items are going to be released. Like, Tokyo Ghoul, Sword Art Online, um... I think free, also like Beyond the Boundaries coming out and all that stuff. But yeah, that's pretty much it for this unboxing. Thank you for watching this if you did. I know this is um, this, this has been unboxed dozens of times. But yeah, thanks for watching 
do appreciate it. Please like, comment, subscribe for more videos like this one. See you guys next time.